What's up guys? I'm back with another video. I went to my local coin shop today. Actually a new coin shop that I stumbled upon today. Uh, and I picked up some more silver. Let's see what we got here. I got four half dollars. There's a Franklin. 1960. They're all in pretty good shape. And a welcome collection. This is actually the cheap welcome to my collection. This is actually the cheapest 90% uh, silver I've purchased. I got it for a buck over spot. And uh, what do we got there? 11 quarters and four halves. So that'll go with the rest of it. And uh, I think I'm going to go back to that shop some more. It's a, it's a pretty big place and they had a bunch of stuff. And they seemed very knowledgeable and kind and willing to talk to you and, and uh, hear what you have to say and whatever you have to spend, they'll take it, obviously. Um, I picked up a couple other coins. Here's the first one. It's a 2011 from the Canadian Wildlife Series. This is the Wolf. 0.9999 fine silver. This is the first coin in the Canadian Wildlife Series. And it has, I don't know if you can see right here on the cheek, it's got a little smudge on it. But the rest of this stuff that you see is not the coin, it's it's just the airtight. Uh, I believe that this coin has a mintage of about a million coins. Of about a million. Uh, which you would think is a lot, but when you compare it to the 2011 American Eagle, which had uh, roughly about 42 million. Uh, One million is not so bad. I paid a pretty high premium for it, but when I look up on, when I look them up on eBay, I think I got a pretty good deal. It was basically double spot price, uh, double today's spot price. Uh, basically, I got it for 58 bucks, which is not bad, from what I can tell. And then another one I got here is also from the Canada Wildlife Series. It's a grizzly bear. This coin is in beautiful condition, with the exception of the back here, where the sticker was on the airtight. It's smudged up, but the coin is in perfect shape. And again, I believe this coin has a mintage of about a million. And this is the second coin in the series. This wolf was the first coin in the wildlife series. And this is the second coin in the series. Both of these coins have exceptional quality. Very, very nice. And they're both the 9999 silver 49s. Anyways, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think about these purchases. I might be slowing down on purchasing silver for the end of the month here. Uh, I think that the silver price might get down to the $28, $29 range, and we might think about uh, making a, a good buy there. But I think maybe for the next two weeks I'm going to slow down, because I see the price in steady decline, at least for a little bit. But I'm not sure. I, I, I'm not an analyst of any kind, but I can read charts a little bit. Uh, so leave me a comment down below. If you haven't already, or, or you know, like the video, subscribe to my channel if you're not already a, already a subscriber. We've got some a great group of guys and gals uh, really pulling tremendous amounts of silver out of the market, making great stacks and great videos, and uh, they can be a lot of help, and we can have a lot of fun. So anyways, do all those things, like the video, subscribe. Let me know what you guys thought about... Uh, my metal detecting, if you'd like me to do some more metal detecting videos, I'd love to do that with you. It's a little more difficult having the uh, the camera and gear just right to do something like that. Uh, something I would love to do for you guys if there's an interest. So just let me know. Give me the thumbs up. That thumb is up, up like this. Anyways, guys, I'll see you around.